For 18 years, Lerone Wilson has been mastering his unique artwork. His East Harlem studio has no paintbrushes, no oils, acrylics, nor clay. His medium? Beeswax with resin. That's right, beeswax. Melted, sculpted, and dyed with rich color. Wax art, also called encaustic, is one of the oldest forms of painting dating back 2,000 years to Byzantine Egypt. Wilson wouldn't share the exact formula for creating his spike and groove textures, but his process involves a series of heating, carving, and cooling. The yellow re represented the true natural color of how the bees make the wax. Three years ago, the economic downturn created a dip in sales. He was forced to put his property in storage and check into a homeless shelter with his wife and three toddlers. They weren't at an age where they question a lot of what was going on all day. They were just with their dad, you know, and they was with their mother. And uh, I think that was more important than anything that we went through. The storage bills added up, and eventually all his possessions were auctioned. It took 11 months to sell enough art to get back into an apartment. He credits God for getting him through the tough times. And I just wanted to make this circular pattern because this was a, a, a shield and, and the grace that was given to me is to keep believing. And that's a part of a shield that I held on to. He held on long enough for a major comeback. Last year in Miami, he won first prize at the prestigious Art Basel show. He sold the winning piece for $15,000, substantially raising the value of all of his work. Why didn't you give up? I, I don't even know what that word means. Give up. Give up. What, what does that word mean? I can't explain. I, I can't even answer that. I won't ever answer give up. This past year has been the most lucrative of Wilson's life. This week, he's back in Miami to expose his work to another host of collectors and turn some more wax into honey. In East Harlem, I'm Rich DiNardo, North Hatton News.